Fuel up, fire up. It's an initiative bringing students and Carmel firefighters together. They worked out together this morning. Nina Criscola was there. Hey guys, we are inside Cherry Tree Elementary School with fourth and fifth graders this morning, all coming out for a workout with Carmel Fire Department firefighters. I'm here with firefighter Tim. We know him well, Tim Griffin. You do have a last name. Yes. <laughs> Tell me about what these kids are doing this morning. Uh, so these kids came out, this is before school, so they all decided to come out and get fired up and healthy with the firefighters this morning. This is a program we've been doing a couple of years here at Cherry Tree. And you know, the kids come out before school. We talk about the importance of health and fitness. And then they have a fun uh, kind of a kind of a boot camp. You know, Steve Edwards, our lieutenant, one of the lieutenants of Carmel Fire Department, puts it on. They do all kinds of fun activities and movement. Uh, their heart rates get spiked. You know, they have uh, that adrenaline from working out. And and we hope that they learn to really fall in love with exercise. One thing I, I I've noticed over the years is kids a lot of times have built-in exercise in their day, whether it's riding their bike or maybe a sports activity. How is it also important to say like sometimes you have to set aside time and really do something specific to exercise when is it, it isn't just a given in your day. Well, that's the thing, you know, as we get older and as they get older, time becomes, you know, as you know, more precious and you have to fit that exercise in. You don't have the time to play like you did as a kid. And so they kind of have to, you know, this shows them it's still fun and it's still playing, but it's exercise. And we put this time, a special time aside before school to get that exercise in. So I think that's a great point. How do you adapt it for kids? Obviously, this is different than what you or I would do in the gym. How do you adapt it to make it fun for kids? You know, it's fun. A lot of the movements are similar, but what we do is, you know, we put some fun names to them. Yeah. We do some boxing here, as you can see. We swat the fly, they frog jump. We add some games in at the end, and they don't realize they think they're playing a game. But the games are incorporating all kinds of muscles and movements, so a lot of fun for them. And you guys finish this up with some good nutrition as well. Yes, yes, we do. We talk about nutrition, and we get them, uh, you know, eating, and just talk about after you after you work out, you got to refuel that body. Yeah, fuel up and fire up. Okay, awesome. Well, thank you so much for letting us come out and see fourth and fifth graders. We're gonna get involved. I think I'm gonna break a sweat this morning if we're dressed for it, and we're out here. We might as well have some fun. Of course, why not?